everyone welcome to another video in this video we will discuss another important feature that is introduced in power automate that is called as format data by example most of the times we format the data right let's take an example this is my account form right in this account form we have three values tpi value registration date and total value in tpi value we are storing values using some pipeline separated values right we have three values which are separated by pipeline you can have many other uh, values separated by uh, space separated by comma or anything that so you can store the data like this you can store data in uh, date right date and time and you can store in a value so this is a number value and this is a date value date and time value and this is a uh, complex uh, value with different uh, data items separated by different characters right with here it is pipeline right the most important thing is how we can get this data and process it to get extra uh, to get the or to format the data for example whenever someone change this value i want to get this second value which is email id so that i can send an email to this person right so anytime some anytime the second value is changed i want to do something that means I, I want to format this data to extract this second value right in here also the date time format is different i can get i can use different date time let's say i want to display uh, october uh, 17 2022 i don't want timing so although we are storing date and time we can choose that what date and time format we can use in power automate like that total value is a number value let's say you want to display as a currency value in power automate while sending an email through power automate then how can you do that right so the point here is we can do that using expressions but writing expression is you know always time consuming so microsoft has introduced a uh, format data by example which is a artificial intelligence integration with power automate so that you just give a sample example of data that you want to extract then it will write expression for you so let us see how we can do that right so my intention is whenever uh, something is changed here in the uh, tpa value i want the email id from this value and format the date in different way and the total value in currency value currency format and i want to send a email to this person dynamically right so let us see how we can do that so go to power automate and create a automated cloud flow why automated because i want to trigger the flow whenever something changed here in this value anything changes here now i'll go here and write down the flow name <coughs> let's say uh, send updated tpa value okay you can choose a trigger called as dataverse why dataverse because the data is stored in dataverse the uh, cell shop app this is so i can choose when a row is modified now what is the logical name of this value let us check use the power of uh, use the uh, level of application uh, extension in your chrome to check the logical name i can copy this this is the logical name now this logical name can be copied now here i have to choose the trigger the trigger is when a when a row is modified right i want to trigger which table the table is account so search account this is how you uh, define the trigger and scope organization i want to run for all um, all account records created by any user which column to uh, trigger the flow this is the column to trigger the flow right so any time this field value changes i want to do something what i want to do i want to leverage the format data by example feature to format these three values so let me take three compose steps i just want to show you how compose step is used for you know uh, data management so just search compose later later you can use uh, send email operation there is no issue choose data operation and then compose right 
now here I want to use the data uh, the format data by example click on this function you will see the new feature here format data by example right in the first compose I want to extract the email ID right so from the email ID means which is a part of this TPA value so it is asking which value which field which field you want to take for data extraction or data format the field is TPA value right now here you can give an example right you want to extract uh, email ID right so just copy this and put it here that means you are trying to extract this email ID from TPA value so now go to desired output it will give you the option right now if you give this value so when you uh, have given dream at the red gmail.com it is giving dream gmail com right so if you want to extract something from here it is also giving suggestion but i want to extract this email id so what you need to do you just copy the total value and give it here then it will give you the output you see so what you want you want uh, the um, gmail right the uh, the option this one the second one so what you can do let's say you want uh, you see po002 is uh, let's say you want this one the first part so click on this and click on get expression now you will see the expression is split trigger and pipeline now to get this it is used zero now if you use one you can get the second one right now you can just click on apply now it is applied but you just change it one now if you change it one what it will what it will do it will extract you see this split uh, function is written by power automate itself you just change something here uh, according to the need because if you specify zero it will extract the first part but i am extracting this one right so you have to use one now next take another example another compose to format date time right now again go to function and format data by example and choose uh, registration date i have registration date here right i want to format the date to display something like this uh, uh, 2022 let's say today's example let me give 2022 then month then date then go to desired output it will give you some suggestions right so which format you want to use in your power automate I want to use let's say this one or you can also specify the hours here right here also giving the uh, suggestion here right so you can use whatever you want let's say I want only the date part with uh, symbol this one this format February 10 2017 right click on get expression now it will get it will create your formula for you right mm td yy now click on apply formula now formula is applied here you do not need to worry about right it will create the uh, formula for you now second compose is done the next is number right number is we have total value so take another compose Now here I want to format data by example using total number, total value and I want to give example what what data total value stores let's say 4000 then go to digital output it will display right which format you want to use you can use let's say it is a number it is a currency field then you can use currency and get expression now it is formatting to number right and you can apply now right now let us save and test how it works I have not written any uh, expression the power automate written the expression for me now test this go here and change some data here let's say dream one two three and po uh, three zero zero three 
and here 5 just I'm changing the values and save it now I'm expecting the power automate will run and it will give the proper formatted data to different compose steps now you can see the uh, flow run successfully and this is the trigger completed successfully in the compose the email id is extracted from that i mean the uh, dpa uh, value is formatted to extract the email id then here the date uh, date and date and uh, year formatted successfully with uh, month then here also the number value is formatted as a, a uh, current right so i have not written any expression but i have used the format data by example and power automate written the formatting expressions for me so this is how it will save your time and uh, productivity it will give more uh, it will increase the productivity by developing the power automate so thank you for uh, watching this video and try to use this uh, format data by example and uh, next time i will uh, prepare another video there is another feature which is introduced in power automate called as describe it and the ai will build the flow for you which is very very interesting and i will prepare a video for that thanks guys bye